Hello everyone, this is Sophia from Textile Content Team. Today, I'm excited to show you the new features we just launched in our mid-November release. Let's dive right in and explore what's new in Texao. The first update is for those who've asked, where can I see my plan? Now, you can easily view your plan by clicking on the sidebar. Right at the top, next to the Texao logo, your plan will be displayed. Whether it's the free plan, agency, teams, starter, or a V1 plan, if you're coming from our previous version. Next up, we have an updated View Your Limits section. When you click on it, you'll now see all your current usage limits, members, workspaces, concurrent executions, social accounts, cloud runtime, data enrichment, and public scraper credits. We've also added organization proxy info, showing how many proxies you have in total, how much you've consumed, and the last sync time. Below this, you can check on API, AI, and integration access, as well as details of your current plan, whether it's pay as you go, desktop unlimited, or something else. This updated View Your Limits button keeps all your usage information easily accessible. A major update is in proxy bandwidth tracking. We're now showing a clear breakdown of proxies you've used and allocated. For example, Texao provides 1 GB of proxy for each workspace by default, so the total proxy visible in the limit section corresponds to the proxies allocated per workspace. Whenever you run an automation for any social media or for sites like Google or Crunchbase platform, it will consume proxies and these numbers will adjust accordingly. This new tracking helps you monitor your proxy use and manage your resources efficiently. We're also preparing to release a proxy enforcement feature soon. This update will require using a proxy or our desktop app as a proxy. After this update, the desktop app will be available across all plans, enabling it to serve as a proxy. To use the desktop app as a proxy, simply open it and ensure it's connected. Next, go to the Accounts section from the sidebar, select the account where you'd like to set the desktop app as the default proxy for all automations on this platform. Under the Proxy column, choose your desktop app. That's it. Your changes are saved automatically, and now all automations for this account will use your desktop app as a proxy. Just make sure the app stays connected. If you want more proxy bandwidth, you can go to Preferences, then Organization Subscriptions, and choose to buy additional proxy bandwidth as needed. For example, if you need 10 GB, you can purchase that directly, and we'll prompt you to allocate it to your workspaces. From there, you can monitor each workspace's proxy info, seeing the total available and used proxies at any time. Remember, each workspace gets 1 GB of proxy by default, which you can adjust based on your organization's needs. Now, let's talk about our new automations. We're introducing several Insights-focused automations like LinkedIn Company Alumni Insights and LinkedIn Senior Hire Insights. For users with premium accounts, these insights let you access powerful data from LinkedIn company pages to create dashboards. These new insight scrapers integrate with our API to let you build custom dashboards, dynamic sheets, and client reports. This makes tracking company insights easier and more valuable than ever for your outreach and data enrichment strategies. That's it for our November updates. Keep an eye out for more exciting automations coming soon. In the meantime, keep running your automations, enriching your data, and engaging your audience. Thanks for watching, and happy automating with Texao!